Welcome to the chapter shape and spatial understanding. This slide presents the overview of the chapter. Learning objectives. By the end of this chapter, you will be able to explain the shapes of some different objects. Identify the objects with particular shapes. Identify the views of a particular object. Trace the objects to understand their shapes. Introduction When we see cartoon pictures, we observe different kinds of shapes like circle, triangle, rectangle, hexagon, pentagon and octagon. How can we compare these shapes with particular objects? Let's find out the answers to such questions in this chapter. Introduction of the Shapes of Objects In our daily life, we are playing with different objects like ball and dice. If we observe these two objects, we may see that the ball is in circular shape and the dice in square shaped like a square. In the same way, when we are watching television, we may see that the shape of the television is rectangular. Similarly, while traveling on the road, we may see a pedestrian crossing signboard and stop board sign at the side of the road. Here we can know that the shape of the pedestrian crossing signboard is triangular and the stop signboard is octagonal. Let us perform an activity to identify the shapes of objects. Drag and drop the objectives in their respective boxes provided below. Let us study how to identify the shapes of objects in different views. Dear children, when we look at the book from its top, it is perfectly square. In the same way, when we look at it from side view, it is perfectly rectangular. But in both cases, we see the same book in different views. So, we can learn that the objects can be viewed in different shapes in different views. Now, we will do an activity on identifying the shape of objects in different views. Knowledge Check Attempt the following questions to check your understanding. Now, let us know how these shapes can be traced through objects. Take a paper and put it on the table. Now take an eraser and then place it on the paper. Take a pencil or marker. Draw the lines along the edges of an eraser. Now, we get a shape which is called a rectangle. Hence, 
we have studied that the shapes can be traced through objects. Here we will do an activity to know how these shapes can be traced through objects. Click each tab to know more. The main objective of this activity to trace a bangle on paper. Take a sheet of paper and place it on the table. Now take a bangle. Put it on the paper. Now take a pencil or marker. Draw an outline of the bangle and observe the shape formed. Here we will observe a shape which is called a circle. Finally, we conclude that the shapes can be traced through objects. Now, we will do an activity to check the understanding of the shapes through objects. Now we will discuss about the shapes of some more objects by opening it completely. Generally, we may receive birthday gifts from our parents, relatives and friends. Take any one of the gifts which looks like a box. Now put the item aside and have a look at the box. Take a pair of scissors and cut gently along the edges of the box. What we have observed here is 5 squares. So from this we get to know that the square-shaped boxes consist of 5 squares. Let us perform an activity to make different shapes by using the sticks. Click each tab to know more. The main objective of this activity is to make different shapes by using the sticks. Take some colorful sticks. Select four sticks from them. Now join the sticks at the edges as shown on the screen such that the shape formed is a square. Now take three sticks and join them at their edges so as to form a triangle. In the same fashion, take 8 sticks and join them. Here we get the shape of a rectangle. We can conclude that the shapes can be made using the color sticks by joining them together.
Let us perform an activity how to prepare a paper boat. Click each tab to know more. The main objective of this activity is to make a boat using paper. Finally, the paper boat is made and we can see square, rectangle, diamond and triangle shapes while preparing them. Practice Joan. Try to solve the question on your own and click Solution tab to verify your answer. Summary. Let us recap the highlights of this chapter. We have seen so many shapes like circle, rectangle, square, triangle, pentagon and octagon. We compared the shapes with objects which are same. We traced the shapes with the help of the objects. Examples like the ball is circular in shape and rubber is rectangular in shape etc. Follow-up work. Draw any two types of objects of geometrical shapes given below. Triangle, square, rectangle, octagon, circle. Use matchsticks or broomsticks and form closed figures using 4 sticks, 8 sticks, 3 sticks. Test your understanding of the chapter by taking the mock unit test. You have successfully completed the chapter Shapes and Spatial Understanding.